Hey Josh, I'm Todd. Just wanted to give you a quick little walk around video so you can see the car. Uh, her nickname is Annie. Red hair, like Annie in the movie. Little orphan Annie. So I'll get some shots. Just wanted you to see some of what's uh, a good, clear indication, uh, full transparency on what the car looks like. Just trying to get some sunshine. Um, so I wanted to let you see, I don't know if you can see, there's a little bit of fading going on on the top surface of the trunk is the primary spot. A little bit of, a little bit of fading on the top surfaces, but the trunk really seems to be the, the one spot. I just wanted to make sure you could see it. I don't know, you know, if you're expecting a pristine, perfect paint job, well, you know, it's, it's, it's not uh, show quality, but uh, it has a real super high gloss finish on the sides still. And, and the top's not bad, um, but uh, it's like fire engine red, cherry, cherry red. Uh, condition it's, it's real good. Uh, aftermarket lights, aftermarket racing wheels, uh, stars. It's a Japanese wheel manufacturer, a three-piece wheel. And, uh, top, top is in uh, brand new condition. And the uh, rear window is uh, nice and clear, clean. No, uh, no issues with the back window. Uh, just a shot of the inside. Fresh leather upholstery. The guy who had it before me put in custom leather, so the leather doors. These handles are off of a Nissan, I'm sorry, Datsun 240Z. Uh, this this knob here, this little control panel knob, is off of a Bentley. I don't know what model it is. Cruise control right here, like I told you, cruise control doesn't work. I'm not sure if, I think it's the control module that needs to be replaced. Uh, it's got new carpet inside. Uh, it's got uh, it's polished stainless or brushed stainless uh, thresholds. Uh, these seats are are out of a 2005 Miata. Uh, so the leathers and it's got head speakers speakers in the headrest, which is pretty awesome. And then you've got a custom little chrome roll bar. Uh, the center console, you've got a center console, and here you're, you've got your trunk lever and your fuel cap lever release. Uh, custom aircraft switches for your windows, so that's kind of cool. Uh, nice knob for your uh, emergency brake and stick. Got a nice stereo unit in here. Got a, a custom wrapped uh, leather steering wheel. It's an NB, it's off of a newer 2004 Miata, the steering wheel is. And then this is a suede Alcantara style uh, custom, custom dash cover. And then uh, it's got a custom stainless steel bezel up on the instrument panel. Uh, electric mirror switches, uh, charger port does work, so you can charge up your goodies. AC works great. Uh, got uh, LED lights in here, little LED lights here, custom LED lights. I've got red LED lights that'll illuminate down here and in the cup holder area uh, at night. It's kind of cool. Uh, glove box got an auxiliary in so if you want to put plug in your uh, iPod or whatever whatever you got and then uh, you could even plug in a, a USB thumb drive got a USB connector in here that goes to the stereo head unit uh, the top the top is in it, it latches good it's fairly soundproof uh, this little bit of trim piece here, it's just a trim piece that covers up the metal bar. 
I just need to get a little a little adhesive. Uh, the sun here seems to have warmed it up and the, and the adhesive came loose. So the uh, trying to get to where you can see it. It doesn't it's not horrible. Uh, like I say, the top is brand new. It just a little adhesive on there. I uh, just haven't got around to it. Like I said, the sun just kind of warms up the top enough to where it just loosened up that adhesive. Uh, okay, let me uh, hang on a sec. Alright, so front end, front wheel. I uh, just wanted to give you a quick, quick view. Got some extra projector lights down there. Uh, aftermarket projector lights. And uh, here's the engine compartment. As you can see, you got a little, little chrome accessory. Pretty shiny. A little chrome. Uh, the engine compartment looks really nice. The, uh, here's just a little quick shot of all the engine compartment. Uh, so you can see what's going on a little bit better. The hood. Wipers work. The headlights, the headlights are the pop up, so you'll see those pop up. As a matter of fact, I can just show you that real quick. All right, so there's the headlights pop, popped up. All right, so here's the right side of the car. Wheels, tires, uh, Toyos are virtually brand new. Uh, a couple thousand miles on them at most. Or a good low pro tire side of the vehicle. Now you might be able to see if you're up close a little bit of paint oxidation, but you know, market everything looks good here. Uh, top, like I said, the top's in great shape. And all the all the rubber seals. They're all in good condition. Uh, the sound system, you, know, you, got, uh, you got tweeters and mids, and, and then this here, down here, is a subwoofer, and it's a custom, custom leather wrapped sub, and it just fits down here in the floorboard. And, uh, and here's the other seat. Like I so said, you got the speakers. And then behind the seat is a, uh, See if I can pop that. Yeah, that's a. Anyway, behind the seat and underneath, underneath the carpet here is uh, the, the uh, amplifier. And then your. And you can see, you know, the window, the rear window, is real clear. And fresh carpet on the rear deck for fresh carpet everywhere. And uh, you're still. Even got the original tag information right here. And here's the uh, rear side. And the tires, great. Um, undersides in real good condition. Uh, muffler is pretty close to new. Exhaust system. Everything looks good back here. No damage. Right side. And then uh, pop the trunk. Oh, and the, uh, it's got an automatic electric retracting antenna that works just fine. Pops up as soon as you start the car and turn on the radio. Here's your leather lined trunk. Try to get to where you can see it. But leather, custom leather. It's been really good condition. Uh, original, original uh, wrap on the spare tire. Uh, here's your battery right under here, and uh, so all this, all this is custom, custom leather. And then uh, everything's in uh, good conditions. I hope you can see this. It's kind of glary. Super sunny day today, and uh, so. All right, so that in a nutshell, 
is uh, Annie. And uh, so everything, uh, everything I can think of to declare I have, uh, sun fading, the uh, cruise control, uh, the top folds down. You can uh, you can unzip the rear uh, plexiglass, the rear window, and you can lay that down. So you can have the rear window down with the top still folded closed like it is. So with the top fully on, the window will pop down. So it's kind of one function. Or you can leave it zipped, and then you can you can retract and convertible, re lower the top completely to where typical convertible. We're cruising in the San Diego. It's a great car. Wish I could own it in San Diego. I think that's going to be a good place for it. So up here in the desert where I live is just, uh, she doesn't feel at home here. <laughs> All the roads are straight and flat. It needs some curbs because this car handles like a go-kart on steroids. It's, uh, it's a really fun car on curvy roads. If you have to drive it straight, it's just, uh, it's just not as, you know what I'm saying? It's like going on a four-wheel drive and never, never take it off-road, you know? So, anyway, okay, there it is. Uh, thanks, Josh. I'll post this and you can check it out.